that. Play intro. <laughs> Why are you gobbing off? Good morning. From the southwest of France. Bloody broken record. Departement says, la chance. Anyway, right, loads of uh, your love and support from you guys. Yesterday on the comments in relation to uh, the absolute faff that we're going through in relation to getting Lisa's healthcare sorted and then another year added to the visa. So thank you. So, um, how do we calm our anxiety down about it? Because it is a very anxious time. Well, you can only control the controllables. So, and that works for us, you know, so if there's anything that's within our power to change or influence the outcome, then that's what we'll do. You know, if we, if we need to make a phone call, if we need to write a letter, if we need to write an email, then that's what we'll do. And once it's sent, once it's done, it's out of our control then. So there is little point being overly anxious about it and catastrophizing about it. So you can only control the controllables. It's not mine. I don't know who's it from, but I like it. So I'm helping uh, Colin out tomorrow and the next day. They're clearing out an old mill. So I'm completely <laughs> uh, ill-equipped when it comes to clothing. So I'm going to go on by myself a pair of proper work trousers, a pair of boots. Because the only boots i got are a pair of Timberlands which cost 200 quid. <laughs> They've got my initials all, all over it. Of course they have. Um, it's when I was back in, the, back in the UK, bothered about fashion, just being a div. And today's the day that I'm meant to be getting the DJI Pocket Osmo 3 camera. The money's out of the account, but I've had no... Um, I've had no notification. Well, I've had nothing from the company, um, even acknowledging the order, but they've taken the money. It's meant to be around today. I had a pet shop called Sackaboose. Flea bag, bag of fleas. Anyway, uh, after I finished filming yesterday, I did some stuff. I'll show you. how to use the old one properly. I'd never had to press that button before, but I did this time anyway. It's nice to have a spare. So, right, let's go clothes shopping. Let's do that. Right, off to Loris for coup. Q slow mo. Say party.
excited. Got the DJI Osmo Pocket 3 Creator Combo. So I'm going to unbox this now. So maybe the next thing that I'm going to record from, it's not going to be this ancient camera. It's going to be from this bad boy. Let's see if it's any better. If it's not, don't tell me. Right, there you go. So I've watched a, uh, a tutorial video provided to me by uh, Jack from Growing in France. Many thanks. So I'm all mic'd up. <laughs> um, I've changed uh, all the set, all the recommended settings uh, to the type of videos that I do. And um, hopefully you should be able to get to see a lot more of the stuff behind. The footage is now in 4K, uh, the audio should be crisper. Um, the auto white balance should be sorted. Don't know. I'll have to check that in a minute. Um, and there should be face tracking. So if I uh, move the, uh, the camera that way, it's going to track my face. So uh, yeah, there's, yeah, there's loads of stuff that I can do with this camera. So tomorrow um, I'm going to be um, helping Colin out. I've got all the gear. Got no idea. Uh, but if it's manual labour, I'm alright with that. I'll see you tomorrow. Oh, but before I go, the camera comes with a, uh, like a magnetic thing. So I'm going to put that on the camera and I'll see whether it makes for a better shot. Right, okay, so let's stick this on. Let's see whether it makes any sort of difference. Has that made a difference? Can't see. Well, let's take it off again. Well, let me know. <laughs> let me know. Anyway, again, I'll see you tomorrow. Before all of that, play intro. <laughs> yes, so where I am with Colin from French Countryside Life. Is my hair a mess? I think it is. Yeah, Make you can just put that brown paper bag, I'll give you just over your head. <laughs> yeah, or the balaclava. <clears throat> so, uh, yeah, today we're going to be clearing a mill. So, uh, a moulin. A moulin. Not the moulin rouge, though. Right, we'll show you. So, all right, so let's uh, go take a look at uh, what the job entails and uh, how far it goes back. So, when I first came to look at this job, um, I was wearing shorts. <laughs> And I thought, there's no way I'm walking into that with shorts. <laughs> so I said, yeah, I'll do it, no problem. And um, I hadn't seen the extent of it, and I was worried about it. I was over-catastrophizing it, apparently. <laughs> uh, but as it turns out, there's going to be a shed load of strimming. Uh, a few trees and saplings need cutting back. But uh, let's take a look. Strimming, metal, strimming. So glad you've got the trousers. Yeah. Uh, strimming, strimming. Back. Stream it all the way down. Now, obviously, because it's a mill, uh, there's a river that runs down the side, um, and the individual that owns the house uh, owns a little island just on the other side of the river. Here, so, got to do that as well. But this is all streaming. Cut down that sapling. Cut all these back. Uh, there's obviously been animals coming through here. Yeah. Um, yeah, all the way back, swimming, swimming, swimming. Now, stay in it. <laughs> I don't know how far it goes back. Right. So, we'll um, keep swimming until we fall off the edge of the earth. Yeah, so that's, that's the plan for that. See this? We found a bridge. 
Yeah, put more on it though. You know yourself. <laughs> yeah, there's coffee break. Um, right by a river. Artisan coffee. Oh, artisan coffee, yeah. And uh, it's a shame that I didn't have the camera on before because Colin and I were tugging out a um, a tree. Shrub. A shrub. And um, it's a bit like Mr. Bean, really, wasn't it? You know, it so was, it's, yeah. um, and uh, we, we tugged furiously. <laughs> and I fell over and got myself covered in the, the muck off the roots. That's a Kenneth William, Williams Valley River, I see. Well, and there he is now. <laughs> Back in shot. So, um, I don't know whether you can see that. That's cleared. Sides are cleared. And uh, right, it's time to crack on. So, in traditional French tradition, um, it's 12 o'clock, can't do any noisy work outside, so we'll have a spot of lunch. Um, what are we having? Pork and beer. Pork and beer. Or pork in beer. Rather. Pork in beer, with frites and... Uh, ratatouille. And you're having the ratatouille? Or am I, am I having that as well? I can't no, remember. I, I can't remember. Yeah, well, we'll see, won't we? I don't like ratatouille. <laughs> <laughs> but, um, yeah, and then white cheese for... For dessert, is it? I think so. Okay. I guess we'll see. <laughs> yeah, that's a look at. That's where we have it. That's the pork and beer. Wheat. That's a chip. That's a chip, yeah. <laughs> and uh, I don't know what that is. Um, Cabbage. I don't know. I've, I've heard about it. <laughs> bon appetit. So, we've done loads today. So we've cleared all this up. Couldn't even see that when we first got in. And uh, all the way around, you can now see the bridge <laughs> and you can actually use it. And so yeah, laters. <laughs>